Thing production will engage the audience through music, dance, and technology in a non-traditional theater experience. Here to tell us more about Stage One's performance of Harold and the Purple Crayon is Andrew Harris. Good morning to you. Good morning. How are you? Good. This sounds really interesting. Tell us about it. Well, you know, Harold and the Purple Crayon, it's a book that's been around for a long time. It's a very simple story about mm -hmm. a little boy, Harold, who goes out with his purple crayon and kind of draws his world, draws himself in and out of trouble. And, uh, you know, very simple book. And so what we've decided is to take this story and put it on stage in a very non-traditional way. Mm -hmm. You know, in the book, Harold is all about his own creativity, his own imagination. And now kids today don't use so much crayons as they do tablets, iPhones, technology. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, and parents are always <laughs> thinking, about how do we get our kids' faces out of the screens? So and we thought, what if we keep their faces in the screens? What if we embrace that and use that and connect it to a play on stage? And so what we've done is we've created a very non-traditional piece where mm -hmm. in the story, Harold never talks. And so we have a dancer who's playing the role of Harold. And as he draws, we're incorporating animation on stage. Wow. So they'll see his drawings you know, live on stage uh, in the form of animation. But at different times throughout the story, we have a character who's kind of a, a storyteller, a narrator, if you will, who actually reads the book with the kids but also invites them into Harold's world. Each student that sees the show, whether it's the uh, 15,000 kids coming to our student matinees mm -hmm. or, or parents bringing their, their kids right. on the weekends to our family shows, uh, they're gonna get a tablet. Wow. And during the show, they're going to have opportunities. They're going to be invited to draw along with Harold on the tablet. We're going to incorporate technology, be able to bring some of their images up onto the screen. And at the end, we're going to be able to process this, collect all of these, and bind them together and send out uh, a copy wow. of your own book that yeah. you've created on stage with the tablet. So you get to be a part of Harold's world, really incorporating that technology into this live theatrical experience. That really does sound very unique, a lot of fun for the kids Absolutely. and parents. Well, and with another component of that is it's going to be, uh, have a live musician, Ben Soli, mm -hmm. who is mm -hmm. you know, well known in this community, a cellist who's amazing, uh, is composing the music for the show uh, and is himself a character in the wow. show. He's going to be on stage playing live along with Harold, with the narrator. So really incorporating dance, music, technology, theater mm -hmm. together into this really kind of multi-arts experience. Yeah, it sounds really cool. If you're convinced and you want to go, Stage One's performance of the of Harold and the Purple Crayon is on March 26th and April 2nd. They're both at 11 a.m. We're going to put all of this information on our website, WLKY.com, so you can find out how you can go. Thank you so much. Thank you. 719 now.